we're on Highway 80 in uh, California in the Bay Area and we are currently on auto steer and auto steer is a part of the auto autopilot program um, it's basically a really good cruise control so we're going about 59 miles per hour and when we get this blinking light it just wants me to put a little pressure on the steering wheel to make sure I'm awake and paying attention if I want to speed up a little bit I can use the wheel use my thumb to go up a little bit and now we're going 62 and it's keeping me in the lane I don't have to hold on I like to keep my hands on my legs close to the steering wheel so if something happened I could gain control right away but it's keeping a really good distance between me and the vehicle in front of me and it's keeping me right in exactly in the middle where I want to be so I really like it if I want to change lanes I can make sure it's clear and I can press the lane change and if it's a clean shot the car will automatically bring me over into that new lane and that's all the car doing I, did, I didn't really do anything I just initiated a lane change so it's really impressive uh, it can take a lot of stress off of you especially on a long drive or if you're in bumper to bumper traffic you do want to keep your hands close to the steering wheel so you can gain control um, something flew out in front of your car like a refrigerator dropped off a truck or something I'm not sure if the car would know what to do so you want to still you know pay good attention when we're watching the road all the time but really like it and again I can use this wheel in order to go faster or slower if I want to turn off the cruise control the autopilot I can either put on the brake I gotta use a little motion in the steering wheel to know I'm awake or I can push up on the stock I'm gonna put my foot on the accelerator a little bit because it's gonna slow down right away I'll push up on the stock and now it goes off if the system feels like it can do auto steer it'll present itself with a uh, gray steering wheel and then to activate it I can just push down twice on this right stock let me do that and then we got auto steers activated <coughs> I'll keep my hands near the wheel automatically makes this turn and even though the speed limit is set for me going 65 miles an hour because that vehicle is going slower it automatically senses with the radar the distance and it's going to keep me at a nice safe distance and reduce my speed if that car speeds up then I'll speed up with it so it's really great again just helps you relax a little bit you do have to stay alert but it takes a little pressure off of you and again to cancel it you can just push up on the stock or you can <clears throat> turn the wheel harder as if you're trying to avoid something in the road and that will turn it off so I just turned it off by turning the wheel and I'm going to press down a couple times I got the blue steering wheel so now it's active so really cool and to make this all work on your settings press the car icon and you can go to let me pay attention to this truck coming in so now the truck came in and the radar senses him and it backed off my speed a little bit you can go to autopilot and you can just turn on this one called auto steer beta and you're all set thanks so much for watching our video and please subscribe when you get a chance and also hit the notification bell so we can send you lots more videos just like this one